What is it? What happened? I have a dream. A dream? Kwa. Is that why you were screaming? I saw her. You saw who? I saw the priestess. Priestess Kosi. Seeing dead people in your dream portrays serious fever. Huh? Uh, I think I have to send for Izog, the herbalist, to come and see you first thing in the morning. Odoka, you never take anything seriously. And I don't like it. Please help me up. You just, you just had a dream. All right. But, but it didn't happen in real life. Our land is in serious danger. And I hope we get out of it. He said... of evil! For so many nights, sleep has eluded me. I've been having series of nightmares, disturbing dreams about this kingdom. So many evil things have been happening in this kingdom. People are dying in their numbers. Some are sick. Brothers and sisters are sleeping with one another. Our healing river has been soiled. Oh. I feel so ashamed, knowing that I paved way for all those unfortunate happenings. I should have listened to Kosi. I should have made use of my kingly wisdom. Oh. Your Highness, calm down. No king is perfect. We are humans, we make mistakes. And I think the remedy is here. The solution is here. Igwe. Igwe. The wound has not healed. So what do we do? Go. Your Highness. Nietzsche. Every day I ask myself. How can we mere mortals wrestle with spirit? Till death no response. Mm. Oh, Agajelu! I wish Agajelu, our great mother, is here. Oh, see, I talk one more than you. I think we should all march from here now to Abu River and let the priestess know that we do not need her here anymore. Linus, Una Linus, 
Don't you think we will be provoking her to anger? Hmm. Don't forget what she did to Jay Ofoka. Your Highness, the Kwabum, Aja the Rokwa. Then what do we do? Do we sit like whimpering cowards and watch our kingdom get extricated? No, uh, Your Highness, let's consult the. Uh... Who shall we consult that will challenge the gods? Hmm? I still suggest that we march to her and let her know our minds. Nothing will happen. I mean nothing. Any one of you here who is man enough to follow me should do so now. King of Anike Kingdom and his council of elders to this place. We have come to see you. What for? Since you came to this land, we have had nothing but pains, miseries, and sleepless nights. What are you talking about? Ujoka, you are evil. Watch your tongue. Watch your tongue, or I will. People of Anike Kingdom. You've, You've allowed, allowed an evil, evil that was, was buried, buried in generations, generations ago to come, come back, back into your kingdom. How dare you! How dare you! Our uh, great mother, mother asked, asked me to, to pass, pass this, this message, message to you. you. And, and what did she say? The people of Anike Kingdom. kingdom. your demeaning utterances and you all will suffer for it. Hey. You will suffer for it. You will suffer for it.
father, you have been moody since morning. What troubles the heart of the great king of Aneke Kingdom? Issues, my son. Issues. The kingdom is in great danger. Hmm. What sort of danger are we talking about, father? I'm afraid plague looms and it might hit us if nothing is done. I'm sure this must be about the priestess and her disgustful lands. Speak less, son. She is dangerous and evil. I don't care, father. I will even fight her if need be. Listen, son. She is not human, but a vicious python. We cannot fight her. So what do we do, father? Exactly my thoughts before you walked up to me. Father, with all due respect, I cannot sit back and relax just because the priestess turns to Python once in a while. I won't. My friend Ugo has been missing and not yet found. Our people can't continue to live in fear. Your subjects, Father, innocent citizens of this kingdom, are dying for nothing. Something must be done. Something must be done. Prince Ekenna. We meet again. <laughs> so tell me, what are you doing here? I'm waiting for my friend to go. Oh, your voice is still harsh. Why do you find it difficult to understand that I care about you? Why do you find it difficult to understand that I don't care about you? Listen, my father and the entire people of this kingdom might be afraid of you, but I'm not. You talk more than your wit, Eken. Eken! Let this be the first and the last day you talk to a priestess like that. Take it easy. Ndo. 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 Ay! 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 Ay
Father, sir. Uduka did this to you because she wanted to sleep with you. Father, she used her evil powers on me. She did this to you? Hi. Nani, Nani, please. Please don't go. Just, just wait. Because... Let her do her worst. Just take care of my son. I'm coming back. Nani. Nani, Biko. Biko. Nani, don't go. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> what is going on here? What's just going on? Eh? I tried to warn your father. I tried to warn him, but he wouldn't listen. He's just so stubborn. And you are just as stubborn as your father. I mean, if you had stayed back in the house, this would not have happened to you. Just stay still, please. Let me put this. It is time I teach the people of Anike Kingdom some lessons as promised. As you wish, Father. Spare the one I love and his family. Very well. <laughs> We won't come down, your highness. Yes. Yes. yes, yes. We have lost numbers of people and loved ones in this village. Yes. 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 Yet you are not doing anything. Mm -hmm. yes. It's too much. Um, it's all right. It's all right. Listen, huh? Diwe is doing everything within his reach to make sure that this situation is under control. Yes. I therefore advise you to be peaceful. Eh? He will he fulfill that because in no distant time. He must make sure this situation is arrested. Yes. Um, your elder, uh, Igwe, with all due respect, you have to do something. You have to do something because um, yesterday I lost my junior brother. Yes. 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 If, I, if we lose yes. any other person, we'll come back here and we'll scatter everything. Yes, 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 it is right for you to tell us to calm down. Look at your house. Look at your home. I have lost a husband. I have lost a family just because of you, Igwe. Igwe, you have to do something. You have to do something so that we will not all perish. All right. Okay, my people. I have heard your complaint. I want you to understand that whatever you feel is what I feel. Exactly. Your problem is my problem. I am your king, but I would like to make a promise to you that help is on the way. Help, mom. Help. When? How soon? How soon? How soon? How soon? How soon? How soon? No, 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 no. My, my people, please, please. Listen, just as the Igwe has said, we feel the same way you feel. We are also people like you. We have people like you at home too. And we are suffering the same thing. Please just calm down. Help is on the way, just as he said. You are here, my enjoy people. yourself. Oh, we are here dying. Look at too people. much. Yesterday, he died. Listen, my people. <laughs> Let us go and give you one more chance. One more chance. One more chance. Let us go and give you one more chance. Just one more chance. Igwe, we'll be back on you. Igwe, we'll be back on you. Let's go. Let us go. Let us go. Let us go. Let us go. This side is even dark. Yes. 
What is it? What happened? We are finished, Your Highness. Our entire village is finished, Your Highness. Talk to me. What is finishing us? Your Highness, our village is attacked by Ogidi. What? As a stream swallowed everybody in the village, Your Highness. We're finished. We are finished. It's all right, Mother. Nothing will happen. How was your night? I hope you had a good night's sleep. Mother, no one sleeps well in this village anymore. I know. No one sleeps well. Where are you going to? Hunting. Hunting? Yes. Have you forgotten that our kingdom is under attack? Mother, I will be the last person to be afraid of Ujuk and her god of Ujuk. I can't turn my feet to jelly just because of Ujuka. You're just a stubborn child. Just as stubborn as your father. You don't listen to your mother. Have you forgotten what she did to you the last time? Have you forgotten? You don't... What is it? What is the problem? I cannot. I cannot. What is it? What? My house is under attack. 
by some dangerous creatures. Give me! Dangerous what? My mother, my father, everybody is in danger. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. She said dangerous creatures. kingdom have felt my stain by now and it is time to pass a message across to them and restate your position so what do you want me to tell them father you monstrous witch have you come here to finish us too, with your evil powers gotten from a coward god? <laughs> I come in peace. In peace indeed. I should have known better to kill you off as a child. A mistake I will forever regret. And that mistake earned you the mercy of Ruby. Because nothing stops him from wiping you and your entire family off the face of the earth. Bastard. <laughs> I understand your frustration. I want you. But you didn't listen. Nobody listened. Ukidi is a benevolent god. Very slow to anger. But when he is eventually angered, it is not easy to pacify him. But before you blaspheme further, I have come to prove a solution. You see, certain sacrifices have to be made to appease Ukiti. Oh, so bad one. Hey! What other sacrifices does he need? When he has succeeded in wiping out almost the entire kingdom? The future of this kingdom lies in your hands. What future are you talking about? It seems you are drunk. <laughs> it's obvious that the priestess is drunk. 
how can she come here telling us about a future she and her gods have taken away from us? Your Highness, please. Please let her speak. All right, go ahead and blab. They are listening. Ugidi has demanded that certain human heads need to be sacrificed to him. Why wouldn't he want human heads? Just let him know that all these humans he's been demanding for will soon be wiped off. And let him get ready to condescend to animal heads. Your Highness. Please. Allow me to talk. Like I said, the future of this kingdom lies in your hands. Ugidi will stop his killing spree if these three heads are sacrificed. Huh? Ichi, onuka. I told you, people. I told you she's drunk. I told you. I will. Queen Akune, you are the first. Never sacrifice my foot. Listen, Mona, you don't need to worry your head on this. What she said is what I call calculated nonsense. Inugo, help me and ask her. Ask her, son. Shut up, woman, and go to your room. Go to your room.
I say, go to your hut. Take it easy, half. It's not her fault. Father, can you, can you imagine? That senseless, confused, insane princess quotes. and threaten the daughter of Ugidi. How dare you? We are I don't care. I don't care where you came from or who sent you because this will be the last time you will speak. in this kingdom night. It is your head the priestess desires tonight. Night, tell me why. Tell me. Why do I hear the night? Tell me. Akum, open your eyes and see what is happening in this land. Calamities everywhere. Huh? If by the shedding of my blood, hmm, this land will have future. Then let me go. Let it be. Hey, no, I know. <laughs> no, no, I know, please. You're not going, please lie. Lie, please. <laughs> I cannot do without you. Now you know that I cannot do without you. Look at our children. How can they grow up fatherless and lie? Tell me. <laughs> at least they will have future. And will be happy to know that their father gave up his life for them to live. Eh? And, and, and listen again. Eh? Look, they will be happier and things will work better for them. Eh? It's a good antecedent. If my name must never cease from the lips of their children. Please, please, please I am begging you. Now look at my face. I am begging you, now, please. Mama. Do you think you can fool him? Eh? Akum, do you think you can fool him? You cannot fool him. He will never let us go away from here alive. That will be worse. Or can't you see it? Eh? <laughs> Stop. Stop. <laughs> Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
save us from destruction. Ube. Ube. What happened? Where are the others? <laughs> Your Highness, we are just coming from Ejaya's house. He has not been feeling too well since the priestess's proclamation. <sighs> Why? Igwe, open us also to see can Agbanaye walk No man feels happy when his days are numbered. But I told them not to bother themselves. Eh? What is their problem? The priestess can say whatever nonsense she wants. But I will not allow anybody to be sacrificed to a cruel god. Ikemba. Yes, Your Highness. Go and fetch Ichi Okafo and the Jaga immediately. At once, Your Highness. Nonsense. I refuse to be intimidated by her rantings. Your Highness. Your Highness, things are getting worse day by day. I know. I know. And I'm thinking of a way out of this for us. Uh, Your Highness, what about our Queen? <laughs> she has not been feeling well too. Hmm. She has been moody for a while. Ugidi hmm. hmm. will have to kill me first. Hmm. Before touching my wife. May the gods forbid, Your Highness. Yes. You will not die. Hmm. At least not now. That sacrifice can never happen. It will never hold. Not while I'm seated on this throne. Let Ugidi do his worst. Let him do his worst. My sister, I still can't believe that this peaceful kingdom has turned into a den of bloodshed. Eh? Oh, bad news all round. Who knows who will die next? Ichi and Chebe's son died last night. Eh? Such promising young man. Who will save us from this calamity? Who? I heard the priestess pointed out three heads to be used for sacrifice in order to appease Ugidi. Are you serious? You know what I'm about that? Who are they? Who are they? I heard the priestess pointed the Ichi Ejara Onuka. And the queen. Eh? Our queen's head. I see one and a more sale. A boy, one more while you see one and a more sale. I mean, Kaif go. We are finished too. I also heard that uh, the king said there will be nothing like sacrifice. Who will allow his wife to be used for sacrifice? This is good in Anna. Let us pray that the gods of our land will one day wake up from their sleep before we all die. Hey! N Let's go. Your Highness, Your Highness, Your Highness, my hand, my hand. Yes, Your Highness, something, something bit my hand. Your Highness, what's the matter? What's the problem? Something, something, something bit my hand. Something bit your hand? Yes. Did you see what it was? No. Is it painful? Please, please, let's let's take him inside. Let me be easy on the hand. Easy, easy. My head for a sacrifice to Ugidi. Hmm. What a difficult decision. 
Oh, my poor wife. How can I abandon our children for her alone to cater for? Why me? Hmm. The kingdom is shattered. The king is sick. No hope for the people. Oh, I have to save my people. And if my head will be the solution to this endless and senseless bloodshed, then so be it. She will soon be here. Undo. Okay, Fabio. The prince, you're welcome. Father, how are you feeling? I feel burning fire inside me. The great king of Anike Kingdom. How the mighty has fallen. Ojuka, please save me out of this situation. I'm feeling so much pain. What did you just say? I should help you? You? My priestess. Please. Please heal him. I am ready to give up myself for the sacrifice. He's a king and his people need him. Ugidi is a god of discipline. If you disobey him, he rewards you with punishment. Until the sacrifice is made, I cannot do anything to relieve him of his pain. I, I, I can't force the others to sacrifice themselves. Stop! 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 Please, Mona, stop! Now you listen carefully, you evil priestess. Nobody, I repeat, nobody will concur to your evil demands. Please, son, please, son, stop. We don't know about when a million dollars of Malia. Man, I can't hear you. When you call him. You have not seen anything yet. More storms are on its way. It will not stop with the king. It can also extend to his beloved son. No, no. You can know. Please leave my son out of this. Anya Mandoya Bo. Opo ma boke mi aboke. You can all know. I, Ichionoka, has decided that if it is the will of my chief that my head be used as a sacrifice for peace to return to this land, so be it. I also tender my head to be used for the sacrifice. You do it. Father, 
No, son, please. There is no room or time for indecision. The sacrifice takes place in three days' time. Like I said, the future of this kingdom lies in your hands. Your Highness, Uvuke is seven rivers and seven mountains away from here. Nobody goes there and returns home alive. Not at all. Your Highness, there are lots of evil forests one has to pass before getting to Mbulango. Why risk the lives of your son, the prince? And the other son, the only son. I wish she had left me with choices. It's the only choice we have right now. I got your love, my prince, mother. Why my son? Why my own son? Why woman because? <laughs> Igwe, Igwe, their safety is not guaranteed at all. Cha 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 cha. Eh? Your son, no? Eh, Jaga son. Yes, they are strong and violent young men. Hehe, <laughs> man, Igwe. Nobody wrestles with the spirit. Mada, no more. Nzeki wala nya. Nzeki na fuzo. You've said it all. Huh? But I'm still wondering if Duego, a Jaga son, will agree to go. Yes. Yes. yes, I don't think you will allow that. I will let myself go. You have to plead with him on my behalf. Yes, sir. Hope, I think, is the only thing we have right now. Your Highness, please. We do not have time to waste. We must assemble them to let them know what they must have to do to salvage this land. Igwe, Biko, I beg of you, Igwe. We're talking of my only child. Only child. One. One. The only one that the gods gave me. Igwe, Biko, please, Biko, no. beg you go for me. Igwe, no, please. I, I can't let myself go, please. Ikemba. Yes, Your Highness. Go and fetch my son. Yes, Your Highness. <laughs> <laughs> Your Highness, Uvuke is seven rivers and seven mountains away from here. Nobody goes there and returns home alive. Not at all. Your Highness, there are lots of evil forests one has to pass before getting to Mbulango. What? Your Highness, why risk the lives of your son, the prince? And the other son? The only son. I wish she had left me with choices. It's the only choice we have right now. I got your love, my great mother. Why my son? Why my own son? Why woman because? Igwe. Igwe, their safety is not guaranteed at all. Cha 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 cha. Eh? Your son, no? Eh, Jaga son. Yes, they are strong and violent young men. Hehe, <laughs> man, Igwe. Nobody wrestles with the spirit. Mada, no more. Nzeki wala nya. Nzeki na fuzo. You've said it all. Huh? But I'm still wondering if Duego, a Jaga son, will agree to go. Yes. <laughs> Yes. yes, I don't think you would allow that. I will let my son go. You have to plead with him on my behalf. Yes, Your Highness. Hope, I think, is the only thing we have right now. Your Highness, please. We do not have time to waste. We must assemble them to let them know what they must have to do to salvage this land. Igwe, Biko, I beg of you, Igwe. We're talking of my only child. Only child. One. One. The only one 
child of the gods, they you can be come. Please, we can beg you go for me. Please, I can't let myself go. Please, Ikemba. Yes, Your Highness. Go and fetch my son. Yes, Your Highness. <laughs> Mother, I must go. What is wrong with you? Do you want to kill me before my time? I am the prince and the future king of this kingdom. For that reason, I can't sit back and watch my people perish. What sort of king do you want me to become? A king that listens to his mother. A, a, a king that knows that when his father is gone, he's the only one that can take over. Our great queen mother knew all this before she chose me. What are we even talking about? You and I know that this kingdom is at the brink of extinction. This same kingdom nearly sacrificed you. Yes. And I would have died to secure your future. I cannot. You cannot die before me. May the, may the gods forbid that. I cannot. I admire your bravery. I wish I was more courageous and valiant in my youth. I'm proud of you. Your Highness, are you in any way... Go on. Allow me to finish. Son. Father. Your mother is right in what she's saying. I will not take side with the great mother on this one. The kingdom has lost so much already. And we we'll still lose more if you take sides. I am not done talking. Where are your manners? I'm sorry, father. You can see my condition already. I am gradually getting unfit to rule this kingdom. I need you to be there to take charge of things for me. Be mindless of what Agajelu said. Father, I understand. Your condition is as a result of the evil that have pervaded this land. Father, you have always wanted me to be brave and self-reliant as a worthy proof to protect my people even in times of difficulty and danger. Yes, you are right, my son. Father, if it is the will of the gods that I will rule my people, then I will go and return safely. Allow me to go on this mission and prove my love. Don't, don't, tell, my me, Igo, don't, tell, Igo, don't tell me you will let him go. Don't tell me you're considering. I cannot. I cannot come back here. Igwe, Igwe, you, you people can't do this to me. He's our only child. Dad, talk to me. Huh? Talk to me. No? Hmm? Let me be. Let me be. Of all the violent warriors we have here, it is you that was chosen to go and perish at Ovoke. And I didn't choose myself. Our great mother chose me. But there are many warriors. You are a prince. The future of this kingdom. And now you're beginning to sound like my mother. Our great queen knows all this before choosing me. The mission is dangerous. I know. I know. Please, why not stay back? Why not stay back? Um, Adam, listen. This kingdom is under serious attack because of my father's mistake. And I'm willing to correct it. Your parents and brothers were murdered by this beast of a god. Wouldn't you like to see their death revenged? But the priestess, the priestess made mention of sacrifices to be done. And that the priestess is no longer to be believed. 
My mother's head will never be used for such delusive sacrifice. This is why you are standing in, in the middle of the road in a deep thought. What is the problem? Diego, my son, run. Run, my son. Run as fast as your legs can carry you. Run away from this kingdom. Why, Papa? The situation is critical and transfer is necessary. Run. Don't ask why. I know, Papa. I need to know. If you must know, you have been chosen by Agajelu to embark on a mission to Ovoke. Where you will meet with uh, the great Ngulangu. Eh? Ngulangu? <laughs> but nobody has ever dared to visit Ovoke. That's why I said that you must have to run and run as fast as I let and carry you out of this kingdom. And my siblings? Why was I chosen? You were chosen because I am the eldest in the king's council. I am my first son. Your siblings can cope with us here. Just run. Why, Papa? Is it because they are girls? You think my life is better than theirs? You are a man. You are a man. Run. I say run. Stop asking questions. Run. It's urgent. No, Papa. I rather prefer my siblings leave this kingdom. Why I stay and face my destiny. If it is the will of the Great Mother that I will embark on this mission, Papa. Then so be it. I'm going to meet with Ken. Come back here. Kings are born, not made. For the fact that we were chosen by our great mother simply means that we are great and special people. But I want you to tell me the truth. Is your mind willingly made to embark on this journey? My prince, there comes a time in one's life that you stand up to fight for the defense of your people. To satisfy your curiosity. I am really, really happy to be chosen by our great mother to fight for the interest of our kingdom. I tell you, you have my full backings. You are truly the son of your father. Hey. Blood rain. Igwe. In fact, we are indeed doomed in this kingdom. Igwe, things are really getting worse every day. Very soon, the priestess will come and demand for the sacrificial heads. Which she will not get. So how I wish we have option. Your Highness, I pray. I pray. Hey. Oh, here they come. Oh, 
Valiant warriors of Anike Kingdom. You are welcome. Mm. None. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Igwe, elders of our naked kingdom, my prince, prince, you are welcome. We have decided to embark on this journey and save the people of our naked kingdom. Irrespective of the danger ahead, hmm. our naked kingdom is greater than any individual. Oh, what brave and courageous sons of our land you are. My prince, we make a man. <laughs> you have done so well, my sons. I will send for Ndishi, the chief priest of Amanasa Kingdom, to have you prepared and do the necessary fortification for the journey. This kingdom will survive. Yes. I will survive. My ancestors must come to our school this time. Uh, I think we should. Uh, uh, Igwe, I think we'll proceed now because uh, we have somewhere to go. Come on. 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 My valiant warriors, you come this way. The prince, you come here. Stop! I am Wobi. I want to see the king. You can see the king now. He is wrestling. <laughs> Even in the jungle where the lion is killed, his subordinates are treated with respect unless you want the king to sleep to death. Go and fetch him now. Are you? I am Wobi, sent by the great mother Agajelo to save guide the prince and his friends to Obike. I see. You mean our great mother Agajelo sent you? Time is not on our side. We are a day. Your Highness. Go and call Ekenna. Also go to Ejiaga's house and call Uduego. Tell Ejiaga to call the rest of the elders. There's an emergency. Yes, Your Highness. Let us go now. How do you? He's not chosen. Wait until he comes. 
For the love of my land, I've decided to follow them back on this journey. How do you intend? Is your way. Listen. You are not there yet, but you are there. <laughs> Good luck. Him. Who knows what he is facing in that in that dangerous mission? Ah. Ghost of our land. Ghost of our land. Please protect him for me. Please. I beg you. Don't kill me, please. <laughs> the woman after the heart of the Prince of Aniki. You have humiliated me. Uh, sorry, I don't understand what you're talking about. Seriously, I don't understand. How dare you! How dare you say you don't understand what I'm talking about? Forgive me. Get Don't off. kill me. Don't be afraid. I, I, I should get her.
you want the prince all to yourself. You want to become the next queen of Anike Kingdom. He even embarked on a foolish journey just to secure a future for you and him together. <laughs> what a fallacy. It's okay. You have nothing to worry about. You can have him. It's okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. for humiliating me. So enjoy it while you wait for it. What is it, woman? What is it that I cannot have peace in my palace? I am worried. You're worried about what? I'm worried about my son. Igwe, I am worried about my son. Yes, indeed she says he's all right. But nobody knows where he is. It is all your fault. Ekenna will be fine. I have told you this time without number. Eh? He is a full grown man who should be allowed to make his own decision. How do you expect me to stop him? Nobody. Nobody has been to that land and came back to tell the story. We all know that. But we must have to allow him with his chin. Maybe that's his death. Oh, God. If anything... If anything happens to my son... If anything happens to my son... I will never forgive you. Never. No, nothing will happen to him. Okay? Nothing will ever happen to him. Nothing will happen to all of us. Don't be afraid, come! Come! You are welcome. Look, I'm your light. To be that tunnel. You hear? I am your light to the dark tunnel. Yeah, go. I said go. Oh, oh, oh. 
the Muhammad's kingdom require the sacrifice of the Lord. One of you must give your life. <laughs> you, you, you mean one of us must die. Hmm. Please don't look at me. Look at the prince. He is the prince of our land. I never knew this would come to this. Eh? Hmm. I thought once we come here, we we'll take the thing and go back home. They will celebrate us. In fact, I'm leaving here. My prince. Ojadike. Hmm? Ojadike. Let me do it. The destiny of our great kingdom lies solely on your shoulder. I am just but your noble subject. Please give me the honor to lead on my life and my, my kingdom. Brave one, step here. 
here.
Come and show the enemies what you are capable of. Come and fight for me, my father. No more go numb. No more go. I'm a member of the boom. No more go. Monstrous deity! You! How dare you? What are you doing on my land? Your land? <laughs> I command you to get out. Get out now!
Is she dead? Almost. But we resurrect triple times more powerful, if not destroyed. The father will soon come to rescue his child. Don't let's finish her. Yes, finish her. 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 Where is Eken now? He said he will always love you. I don't understand what you're saying. Where is Eken now?
so cruel. I lost everything. <laughs> Even the man of my heart is nowhere to be found. My life is in shambles with no one to care. No one to care for me. to play for without friends without family <laughs> life for you to live. Please, don't let his death be in vain. Uh, uh, you mean the baby? What baby? I and Ikena mated before he left. And we chowed. Oh my God. May our great mother be praised. This is good news. Good news? You mean good news? How can I have this baby in this condition? Can't you see? <laughs> Ata, you will be fine. By sundown, we will be at Abudu River. We will wait there for our great mother to return and heal the land. I give you my word. You will be fine. Please. Father, Father, help me. Father, help me. You have to do something, Father. Help me. Help me, Father, help me. What I won't work. What I won't get woo. If I won't get woo. If I won't work.
I'd like to thank every one of you. It's been a challenging and stressful production. Stressful not because of logistic problem, but stressful because of the, the demands of the job, the demands of the script, and the demands of the location and the setting. For me, it's been one month and a few days. For the crew member, it's been 25 days and all that. My name is Stephen Onaji Onche. I'm a filmmaker. I specialize in 3D effects and animation. I'm also an editor. My name is Sefaya Noye. I'm a Nigerian movie producer, one of the assistant production of production manager association. My name is Opale Kechigoze Donald, aka Abuja, the production manager on set. Mr. Good News, Eriko Isika. Wow, the cinematographer on this set. My name is uh, Akim Unilobo. I'm a special makeup artist, so Tricks International. My name is Augusto Testimony, Meme. I worked as a process set designer in this production. My name is Joan Eze, the makeup artist of this great project. My name is Austin Ifani Onyema. By the grace of God, I am the continuity man on this set. My name is Peter Felix Obo. By the special grace of God, I am the stiff photographer of this job. My name is Lugweba Ochukoma, and here is um, Richard Tim Eze. And here is... My name is Oka Imano Chimobi. We are the production assistant in this job, and we thank God for everything. It was a success. Thank God. Yeah. Yeah. My name is Anene Emeka Ferdinand. Popularly known as first movie. It's very hard to convince me about something before I could believe in you. When the story came, I was like, I don't see much in it, but when we put it together, we are able to bring out up to something. The people that work with me, I will start from the director, Monsieur Emeke Kwe, the director did job for me. Even the my producer Ifani and the the special effect Steve Onaj and the, even the the special makeup and design sets Akim uh, they all did well even the PAs and the PM Abuja you know I didn't know what to say but let glory be to God.